Hi, this is Abdul Aziz Khan with my today's uh, headline news. Uh, another new protest started in Atlanta after police they shot a black person and he died. Uh, the police chief has uh, resigned, but uh, still this shows that uh, police is not able to handle protesters. They still don't know that how you handle a protesters. So this is a very uh, strange kind of thing. I mean, it has been many days and uh, it looks like that uh, the police is not, uh, I mean, there are no strict action because there is no strict action being taken against the police. So police is not uh, getting the real message. They still think that uh, because no one is asking them to change their behavior. So they are just asked to stop the protesters so they are still doing what uh, they think that what they should be doing so they are doing what they are generally taught to do and if uh, as i said earlier as well that if the things should go like this for a very long period of time then it will have its own consequences if the same thing should have happened in uh, any country in for example in Africa or East or uh, Middle East then maybe UN should have or NATO should have sent its uh, troops to control the situation and saying that the democracy is in danger and people are at risk so the people are at risk here as well, but uh, because this is US and uh, they are not even though they are not able to handle it, but still nothing of a big uh, level is going on. Only these kind of things. Biden urged to urge to pick a black woman as running mate. We know very well that these kind of black people who went to some big position under these kind of pressures, they cannot uh, even handle that pressure. They cannot do anything because they are also, they have not come through a normal procedure. They have come through some special measures. So they are not as... Uh, uh, as effective as, as if they had come through normal procedures. So that's why if they had come from normal procedure, they should know that even if they are not able to do it, someone else should come from the same uh, way and then he should do whatever is required to be done. But if a person is just elected because of uh, grown pressure of to bring the black people in uh, high level positions and that person should not be able to do anything which is uh, really required. The requirement is still the same that there should be reforms, things should be changed. Um, black people or Asian background people or whatever people who were left behind because of these racial things they should be made part of the mainstream so that they can climb to any level based on their abilities, not because of any uh, growing pressure. So, Philippines casino catering to illicit Chinese gamblers as causing or causing kidnapping and chaos. Birds are not all singing the same song. Yes. So, an observant Sikh woman graduated from US Military Academy at West Point. Now this observant Sikh, I mean, how many years it took US to allow an observant Sikh to graduate from its military academy. These are the things that should be 
um, looked upon they should see that what are the problems in the system why this has become a news this should be a very normal thing which should be happening day and night you don't need to report it so new zealand is back on track there's a rugby match and uh, no mask nothing people enjoying their life so things in uh, new zealand looks fine and we hope that they remain fine but let's see because i am still not fully optimistic uh, as we have seen that china also get some thing again so i'm not saying new zealand is a very small country with very less population it has no uh, relation with china it has no comparison to china but still uh, they should still take care of it they should not go just fully open so bbc also has the same atlanta police chief resigns over the death more than 100 arrest after violent london protest france police clash with anti racism activists so anti racism is we can say everywhere now beijing supermarket closed france ancient barrier brotherhood so these uh burial brothers who came they were founded in 12th century they feel that they need to come back and uh, because france is maybe pressing for a second big wave some countries they look it looks that for example a danger is coming to you and uh, you don't want to do anything you are ready to just ready to die kind of thing i mean so pressing for a big number of death when they are not ready to lock down or to avoid it somehow say okay if it is coming to kill us then let's embrace it let's go further and uh, make it fast and easy this is what i feel that some countries are uh, following this kind of thing like now these are anti racism protest in paris so that's why they are uh, managing to make uh, some organization to bury these guys because uh, they will catch corona and then they will die very very strange kind of thing so pakistan is also having a very big number and uh, deaths are also there not still not too much i mean as per the government uh, understanding but uh, still people are dying so china is bracing for a typhoon nuri uh, also hong kong opens a park but with social distancing only two people sitting and uh, a lot of rain now this is the beauty of china i mean you see this only one small rain in an area and 700000 residents if you compare this with new zealand then you already understand that how new zealand came out of this maybe this was the whole population of new zealand so syrian also doing something good for the doctors to cheer them up so this was the news that i was uh, china report 57 new confirmed cases china was having almost zero cases for many days and then they got a lot of cases so uh, new zealand is very very different than china but still they should uh, take care of their people they should not let everyone go out uh, that openly i think they should still uh, make some kind of precautions 
so apart from it shinwa has uh, no big news so london has rights as per al jazeera and uh, egypt also corona corona numbers very high so this is the us cities where uh, protest happened for george floyd it's almost all the us which is a kind of good thing so atlanta also has protest and lebanon has protest on some other reason and uh, nepal parliament approves new map china is fully backing nepal and china wants them to fight india on their behalf so china is always busy now these monuments they are being uh, destroyed i don't know uh, what good should come out of it i mean i have personally no problem but you spend public money on putting these monuments and you will spend public money to destroy these monuments i mean what kind of uh, good thing it is so writers don't have any big uh, news uh, mainly this atlanta press chief resign so these are generally the same kind of news china report new cases world number of deaths is going up and up us some went down and then up this went down and then up so us also has a good uh, number still british queen uh, she celebrated her birthday during the pandemic one uh, yes. initially it looks i mean a black man is holding a white man so you cannot understand what is going on so far right people far right and anti racism protesters cover basically so they are, he is not holding his brother i mean they are maybe fighting with each other these are some news which are i feel a bit uh, interested news i mean don't let the corona crisis go to waste virus crisis should be opportunity to reform country you know that this theory of uh, that there's everything this is all planned and uh, conspiracy theory and now why do why a premier need a pandemic for reform i mean this reform kind of thing it came from with the pandemic why the reform cannot be done normally it's just a question i mean it's uh, a point to ponder that uh, something is brewing under this uh, corona virus that i don't know i mean allah knows better but uh, so protest again grew plus shot another person and uh, let's see how it unfolds let's meet tomorrow but